Okay, this is this is a um, uh, a Des and Jeff watch stuff uh, impromptu uh, video right now. Uh, we're on our couch. It's Friday night. We just got done watching the Fallout TV show, and uh, I wanted to get this up online to let everyone know what we thought. Because I know you're wondering. We're um we we are drinking though, so it is a drinking video. Got my gin and tonic here. Mm. Alright, we're both really big fall fans. Um I could get a little neck beardy on this, uh, because there are have some problems, but overall I'll just say I really liked it. I liked it a lot. Guys. <laughs> <laughs> it was probably the best show we binge watched in a while, right? Yeah. Yeah. I, uh... I loved it. Yeah. What about the ending? Don't spoil it, but what about the ending? Are we done crying yet? <laughs> <laughs> it was it was awesome. Yeah. And she has her fallout blanket on too, her Voltec fallout blanket. Yeah. Yeah, we were all ready tonight. Um <laughs> we started watching it on Wednesday, but because of other things we couldn't get through all eight hours or nine hours of the show um on Wednesday, so we split it up Wednesday, Thursday, and here it is Friday. Wanted to get this online because it was um, it was really good. Uh, I'm surprised how good it was. But I got to think about this: the guy who uh, was producing it helped write it and all. Jonathan Nolan, uh, Christopher Nolan's brother, did a lot of really good stuff. I mean, he, The Dark Knight. Uh, you know, he's Westworld. I, I, I believe he wrote Memento. I'm not sure either him or his brother. So there was a lot. There's a lot of really good talent behind this and the attention to detail was just wow yeah amazing amazing yeah uh it was it was good thoughts i don't have any right now um <laughs> it was just it was so good it yeah it was we just so good and and i'm i'm happy with it because they really could have messed it up bad yeah. yeah yeah but i think one, once the last of us came out they were like, okay, we need to make, if we're going to make a TV show about Fallout, we better do it right. And even though um, Jonathan Nolan said, like, oh, he's not out to p please the fans, I pretty much think he pleased the fans with and, this one. why wouldn't you? Yeah. Well, the whole thing, the, 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 it, was, it was taken out of context, but what he said was, like, it's almost an impossible task to please everyone. It's kind of what he meant. It was like, right because there are still some people. Oh who are, yeah, mm, yeah. About there's there's things. yeah there's some people. Now I do have some nitpicks, very very small nitpicks. I'll just say if, if you, you got a little nerdy on me right after the show. I I, I did I did, and uh, just so anyone that's wondering that is a Fallout fan, especially a Fallout New Vegas fan, they didn't destroy the Fallout New Vegas canon. They didn't destroy that. New Vegas is still there. We'll just say that it, they didn't like retcon much. A little bit, there was a little, little bit was, you know, some dates are a little mixed up. If you want to really get into lore, but the only thing I didn't like was the NCR, which is a faction in the games, uh, was depicted a little, little weird. Uh, not exactly how I think they should have been depicted. But we but might find out why in the future. In the next season, it may not be what we mm -hmm. think. Yeah. Everything was was good. I mean, anything like that. You, if you played the game, you can you get more out of it. I think. But would I recommend it to a, a non Fallout fan? Absolutely. I think my mother should watch it. Yeah, I won't watch it with her. No. But <laughs> no. even if you're not a fan of the games, I, I really think you get a lot out of this eight episode series. What do you think? I think so. Yeah. Yeah. It's and it's maybe you'll become a fan of the games too. Yeah, and we could. All play together. Yay. All right. That's about it. We're going to go back to drinking. See you soon.